dream being real right now, now, now If it wasn't working, I'ma work it out, 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 yeah I keep on going till the lights go down, yeah Let me interrupt my bickering neighbors for just a second and tell you welcome to the Lone Star Hawaiian Garage If this is your first time tuning in, my name is Chad Naho'oleva Thank you so much for spending your valuable time with me, and welcome to the channel. It's okay, get off of me now. <laughs> Thank you. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's a great time to tune into the channel today because we're only 200 subscribers away from 10,000. If you remember a few videos back, we talked about a 10,000 subscriber giveaway. With only a few days left, hurry and be part of the subscriber giveaway contest. This is how you do it. Number one, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Scroll down, hit that subscribe button, be part of the Lone Star Hawaiian family and part of this community. Simple enough, number one. Number two, find me on Instagram. Follow me at Lone Star Hawaiian and find this photo. Find this photo, leave a comment, and at 10,000 subscribers, one lucky, two lucky, not three lucky subscribers will be chosen from the comments on this photo, and we will be revealing who those are when this channel hits 10,000 subscribers. All the details on what the prizes are, rewind back a few videos, go check that out, all the rules, all the details on the contest on that video. So with that said, we're gonna take a quick detour to the number one destination spot in YPO. Costco. So I'm actually meeting my wife here at Costco and she told me, hey, we're parked in our normal spot. So, wifey, me. Wifey, me. The very back of the parking lot. And all the way over there is the entrance to Costco because this place is absolutely nuts. Let's begin the adventure. a little bit about what we're gonna be doing in this video today Lost Fit has in fact sent me a set of backup reverse lights for the 2007 Silverado now the tail lamps we have in the truck are aftermarket but they utilize the stock bulb for the reverse light currently we have some knockoff Amazon brand LED light but I want something a lot brighter. When I'm backing into my garage, when I'm backing up anywhere, especially at night, the more light out the back, the better. The less likelihood you're gonna run into something because you can see a lot better behind you. So, Lost Fit came in clutch because I asked them in our last video, hey, you guys send me a set of these backup lights. I wanna install them, so they did exactly that. So, Lost Fit, thank you so much for sending these out. Let's go ahead and get home and install them. And here comes my wife. Sean, I'm on now. Got a long way to go, won't slow down. I've been staying up too long now. Sun coming up. She's actually a really, really good driver. I would never tell her this, and the only reason I'm saying it in the video is she never really watches my videos. So I can compliment her all day long and say, she's the best female driver I have ever seen in my entire life. She'll never know. But on top of all of that, of course, we have an additional agenda today, which is changing the oil on that Mercedes. I just gotta get it done. So when we get back home, we're gonna change her oil real quick and then we're gonna pop in the brand new tail lights. I'm excited because I've been wanting these things and my reverse lights aren't looking very good. So let's fix that. Hey, so technically I beat you home. Just saying. I really beat her home. Winning! <laughs> We are home. It is time to service the car. It needs an oil change, and we're actually gonna go ahead and rotate the tires while we're working on it. All right, see you later, dude. <laughs> dawned on me that this motor is incredibly hot which means the oil is gonna be just as hot and I'm gonna burn the crap out of my hands but here we have a Mercedes C230 compressor this is a 2000 model it's a 2.3 liter four-cylinder motor 
that's supercharged from the factory. So that way down there is a supercharger. Yes, it is. And it only makes about 150 horsepower, 150 pound feet of torque. So not much. And to be honest, it doesn't get very good gas mileage either. And then we have another one of these trusty old change boxes. Dang it. I hate this car. This car seriously makes the most simple tasks extremely difficult. I hate it, but my wife loves it, so we're stuck with it. Oil change is done. Time to rotate the tires. We're just gonna do a simple front to back. So let's grab those power tools, knock this out really quick. good to go for another few months at least so she can leave for school in the morning we can call it good and next chance we get which will be just in a second for you guys we're gonna pop in these brand new lost fit LEDs into the reverse lights of the Silverado so you guys have a great night or a great second and then I will see you in three two one and welcome back it's raining outside now so take a look at this rainbow You guys have never seen a full rainbow? These are everyday occurrences in Hawaii, but because of this rainbow is a little bit unique in the sense of we have another hurricane coming. I have water in the lens, so, all right, that's better. So again, we have another hurricane coming. It's actually a tropical storm technically right now. It's coming from an like entirely different direction than Hurricane Lane. Hurricane Olivia, come on down. And actually it's a double rainbow if you take a closer look. So we have the main rainbow and then the secondary rainbow. All right, so back on subject, we're now finally getting to the truck. We're talking about the backup reverse lights. So those bad boys right there are coming out and getting replaced with some brand new Lost Fit reverse lights. So let's look at exactly what we're talking about here. The backup reverse lights from Lost Fit, one year warranty, US brand, the actual part number, white in color, sorry if it's a little bit blurry, 3157. 3157 is the part number. Here is the original halogen backup reverse bulb. So we pulled these back out of storage. We're gonna take a look at a few things here. So we have our brand new ones. We have the ones from Amazon I bought about three years ago that are on their way out. So if you take a look there, we do have a few LEDs out. We have a few blinking, which are on their way out, if you can tell there. So. These are coming out. These have done a great job. Again, we've had these in for three years, bought them off Amazon. I think it was like 15 bucks at the time. So let's pull these tail lights back out, pop out these reverse lights. And what we're gonna do first is plug in the stock halogen bulb. We're gonna pop these back in, take a look at what it used to look like coming stock. Hey babe. Hi. And then we'll do a comparison from stock to the lost fit LEDs. Super stoked about this, lost it fit. Again, thank you so much for coming in clutch on this. Let's check these out and see how bright they are. Okay, pulling tail lights off, super simple. Two screws here at the side, pops right out. And then here we have the Amazon LED. So one last look on the brightness here. And there you have it. These are coming out again, they are on their way out. You can see that blinking set of LEDs there going on and off, they're on the way out. Um, have a few actually out completely. So let's pull this out, I'm gonna pop in the halogen on this side, and then on the passenger side, let's pop in the brand new Lost Fit LED. So, there's the LED, that's out of there. Stock halogen going back in. Normally you'd wanna use gloves on these and not get the oil from your hands on them, but they're coming right back out after, so it doesn't really matter. All right, 
So halogen is back in. Pop that back in. All right, here we go. Okay. There's the old stock halogen. Here's the Amazon knockoff LED. Back to the halogen. There we go. Okay, so here they have the brand new goodies. We have five LEDs on each side. Now it's kind of unique in the sense of how it's shaped. So you have two LEDs kind of facing forward and the remainder of the four facing up and down. So let's pop these in to the housing, plug everything back together, and we're gonna see a nice comparison from the Lost Fit LED to the stock halogen. That fits in a lot more snug than that other one. All right, that's good. Just make sure that this is gonna work. Probably plug it all back together. Oh, that's right. Woo! Look at that. Dang, that's awesome. So I'm partially blind now because I look directly to the light. That's wonderful. So that's back in. Holy crap, that is bright. <laughs> All right guys, so we have the stock halogens on the driver's side, lost the LEDs installed on the passenger side. Let's take a look at the huge difference we have between those ugly stock ones and the brand new lost fit LEDs. But first things first, we need to turn the lights off, so let's take a look at this. the stock halogen and then our lost fit LED. I really don't need to say anything. Look at the difference. Would you look at it? Would oh. you look at that? Just look at it. Just look at that. I mean, just get a look at that because we had to look at it. Look at it. <laughs> it looks like that side's not even on, or you're not even operating. Look at that. Just look <laughs> at it. Lost Fit LED, stock halogen. Enough said. All right, Lost Fit. Once again, very well done. I did not expect that to be that bright. I am really completely honestly astounded. So enough of me talking. Let's pull out this ugly halogen bulb, swap it out for the brand new Lost Fit, and we're gonna call it a night. Exactly where I wanna be. I am where I wanna be. Remember the star, remember the star. When my future needed clarity, yes, I needed clarity. So I could see how you'd react. gentlemen here we have the finished product the lost fit led backup reverse lights absolutely bright as heck super happy with them check out how bright that is and if you missed in the last video we installed led lost fit cargo lamps there at the top and the third brake light so that combined with this we don't even need garage lighting so we went originally from our stock halogen bulbs here to the knockoff amazon ones these did pretty well but they are by far outmatched by Lost Fit. So these are gone, these are gone, and here we have Lost Fit lighting, LED, part number 3157, white in color. Go check them out, guys. This was absolutely fantastic. A great install, a great product, super good quality, and extremely, extremely bright. Thank you guys so much for tuning in with me tonight, and staying tuned is effectively night, so it's time for me to go inside. Go to bed. I got work in the morning. So, aloha. We'll see you next time. And I'm out.